American farmer has become the world's most productive manager. To his resource of land, he applies his time, his energy, and his tools. Through innovation, he's become incredibly efficient. Alice Chalmers has kept pace with him, designing and building equipment with increasing performance, reliability, comfort, and efficiency. A perfect example of this innovation is the popular 6000 series of tractors. Farmers who own these tractors say they're the finest 60 to 90 horsepower tractors ever produced. They've set new standards in performance and economy. Yeah, it's done more than I thought it would. Is that right? From the time I had it, it's done more than I thought it would. I hooked it onto a set of five bottom plows. When Joe brought it over, we had, we had all our corn in except about, uh, we had six acres that was plowed that wasn't in, and we had about six acres that I wanted to plow that was on wet ground. Mm -hmm. And there was actually water standing in the wet holes. We don't have very much wet hole, very, very much wet ground here, but up on the hill. And I called that. Just about everything. It's, uh, it's been my hay cutting tractor, sometimes bailing tractor, plowing, disking, speed grinding. Matter of fact, that's one thing I like about it. The size of it, it's versatile. Well, up to this point, I mean, I, uh, it's, it's, it's the best one you come up with yet, I think. Well, thank you. Uh, they needed this for a long time. Uh-huh. Uh, consumption, fuel consumption, and I mean, it's just one. But uh, so far, I mean, I really like it. What makes these tractors so well-liked? It's their outstanding performance. In fact, these tractors significantly outclass the competition with their ratings. One important area is lugging ability, or torque rise. The model 6080 at 83 horsepower is turbocharged and intercooled. And based on official tests, it has the highest torque rise in its class, 27%. The 6060 at 63 horsepower also tops its class in torque rise with a whopping 35%. And here's what the owners say. From 1500 on up, there's just no stopping it. <laughs> You can slow it down to 1500 and bring it right back up. You can, you can pull it down and it'll go into a lug and just stay there. It doesn't keep losing RPM at that high end. Mm -hmm. I'm very impressed with that. Like a 16 foot column mulcher. We hooked that right on it the first day we had it. I was amazed at what it did on it. Now you'd expect that this much reserve power would probably require heavy fuel consumption, right? Wrong. Again, in official tests, the 6080 has the best fuel economy in its class at 16.68 horsepower hours per gallon. And the 6060 scores near the top of its class at 15.82 horsepower hours per gallon. Was there ever a better time to have this kind of fuel economy? Let's hear what our owners say about it. Um, bond where it used 10 out of 9 horsepower, where I was really pulling it, you mm -hmm. know? Mm -hmm. I couldn't get four gallons an hour through. It was close. Mm -hmm. And like cutting hay and grinding feed, I think it's running about two. So your that is amazing to me. But, uh, we could run more than one day on a tank of fuel. That's great performance and power with no sacrifice in economy. Now, there's a way to make these great tractors even better with front wheel drive. Listen. And boy, that would pull it. And I pulled it out of four-wheel drive, and it wouldn't even move. It would just sit there and chew. Pull that back in four-wheel drive, and it would walk right away. But I guess it was 6.7 mile an hour that I'll have another four-wheel drive in. In this actual demonstration, a front-wheel drive and a two-wheel drive are pulling identical moldboard plows set to the same depth. The difference is obvious. Tests show that you can do up to 25% more field work on the same amount of fuel with front wheel drive. It increases your total field performance with better traction and fuel economy and with less compaction and tire wear. These tractors may skimp on fuel, but they don't skimp on comfort and operator convenience. The cab is roomy and the visor design keeps out unwanted sunlight. The door opening is 36 inches wide 
and the comfortable seat has fully adjustable suspension for a smooth ride. With 40 square feet of tinted safety glass, visibility is excellent, and you can easily see the drawbar and three-point hitch through the rear window. Hydrostatic steering provides easy fingertip control and shock-free operation. Among the other features, you'll enjoy synchronized transmissions for quick, easy shifting on the roll. The 6060 has eight forward speeds with four in the work range. The 6080 has 12 speeds, five of them in the work range. Hydraulic wet disc brakes give you quick, safe stops and tight turns. There's a mechanical differential lock to keep you moving when traction is poor. The 19 GPM hydraulic system easily handles heavy implements and loader work. You can choose position control or traction booster for precise control of mounted equipment. The Category 2 three-point hitch has lower link draft sensing for responsive implement control, and the lower links are extendable up to five inches for easy hitching. Daily maintenance doesn't have to be a chore. Two latches release the durable yet lightweight hood panel, revealing the entire engine area. At a glance, you can check the coolant level through the transparent recovery tank. The battery is right there for easy inspection. And you can easily service the dry type, high capacity air cleaner. You can even fill the large 32 gallon fuel tank while standing safely on the ground. Of course, we could describe many more features that these tractors offer. But why not see your dealer for a demonstration? The 6060 and 6080. They've got everything you want in a 60 to 90 horsepower tractor. Outstanding field performance with powerful torque backup. Excellent fuel economy in both two or front wheel drive models. And a quiet, comfortable cab. Drive a new 6060 or 6080 and see for yourself why they're called the performance leaders.